What is up, guys? This is your host, Chill, Chill Speaking, and welcome back to Let's Play Roll Pond 2. The last episode, we went and destroyed the battleship from Senior Zero back 20 years ago. In this episode, we're gonna do. Well, let me. Before I even say what we're gonna do next, we are allowed to go to the next and last place, Death Guy. But in this episode, we're not gonna do that just yet. We wanna um, decide our future and last set. Well, set our t our last team. And I've decided, you know, maybe it's time to go somewhere fresh. Well, let's go a fresh, a fresher route. And you know, as much as I love my soul and Bolton and everyone else. I think it's time to, you know, get a fresh look. Maybe I am gonna train them a little bit and see where, um, by by them I mean the new roll punt we got, which is Negapon and um, Giddy Up, and see which one is uh, more suitable for battle. So you're gonna guys, you guys are gonna see just that. But in this episode, we're gonna go to the mushroom shop. Now you might, you guys might not remember, but I surely do. And Back two episodes ago, or one, I happened to find myself convincingly and coincidentally a red mushroom. It says red mush because it, does, it doesn't fit the whole text. Darn you 8-bit games. Well, it's not 8-bit, it's probably more than that. So. I don't know what I'm talking about when it comes to making games. But in this episode, we want to get a certain... Well, let me explain how this mechanic works. In this episode, we... Well, in this part of the game, or this part of the level choice, um, mushroom shop, there are three mushrooms you can find. A blue mushroom, a yellow mushroom, and a red mushroom. Now, these mushrooms can be turned into spirits, or called upon, by this guy. Each of these spirits give you a special perk for a special amount of time. Whether it's 300 steps, or a certain amount of battles, or something like that. We want to find a spirit that gives us a very, very special ability that involves getting roll pods. But to do that, we're gonna have to get lucky. So, knowing my luck, I'm not lucky. So, <laughs> so, we're gonna have to retry. I mean, I'm gonna try it once, and then I'll cut off. If we get the person, slash spirit, slash her, then I'll just leave it on. But if we don't, I'll just cut off until we get the right spirit. So, let's go. <laughs> hey, mushrooms, I can make you a spirit now. Oh, you can make spirit? That makes no sense. I wonder which one will appear. Use the red mushroom to resist spirit? Yes. And that is weird. So, let's see what we got. Um... We got Haya. I don't think that's the one we wanted. I am Toyu. Toyu. I'm the samurai hero of cross version. I'm not happy with a few names of Ropan names, so I'll change them. It's a little past deadline, but don't you do you mind, do you? Make K. Okay. Well I have some killer names though. Up so I'll let you know. I'm kind of tired of rough random battle. Though, so after 30 battles, I'll get pretty fed up and leave you alone. No joke. So sit back and let me work my mad editing skills on your party. Uh, what? Yeah, I kind of don't know half of these robots. But this is not the robot we wanted, so we're going to cut off until we get the robot we want. BRB. Okay, guys, so this is the spirit we actually wanted to find. Are you happy? I am Tatkako, the spirit of true happiness. You must have courage to go forth and spread your happiness with others. Happiness can even make stone springs spring to life. When we're together, I'll bring fossilized Ropan back to life. Won't you be happy to bring Ropan back from the past? Sadly, our time together will end after you've taken 500 steps. Let's go find some fossilized Ropon while we still have time together. Be happy. Alright, so yeah. You guys might remember, there are a few Ropons spread out in this game. 
that we could get because they're fossilized and one of them is in Baba Village. Now I won't be showing you guys all of these rope fonts. Uh, that's not good. What the heck is this guy? Doing? Um, yeah. That was a horrible lag. Jeez. All right. Um, like I was saying, guys, there was supposed to be a one in Baba Village. Um, where is there's also one? Well, I actually don't remember half of them. I know there's one here in town of Wanda. Was it? <laughs> I don't remember half of these. I'm terrible with name, guys. I am very, very sorry. That was a terrible lag, and I am very sorry about that too. Uh, I know there's a oh, pawn around here. I did say fossilized, right? Jeez, I feel like an idiot at the moment. And I'm wasting my steps. That's great. That is fantastic. Unless I... Unless, unless it's in the past. No, there's one here. Oh, come on. Okay, guys, I'll be right back. Okay, so upon storing my roll pawn, um, we have a fossilized roll pond over here. So we're gonna get three, and it's a scooter. So here's a scooter. Um, yeah. It's a pretty interesting roll pond, I might say so myself. But now we wanna go to the past. Actually, we're gonna go to the, uh. Hmm. Delhi Castle. And all the way in the basement, we're gonna get. A special roll pawn. Now, if my princess or my beautiful, beautiful wife here runs out of steps, um, I'll probably just cut off and um, show you guys the third roll pawn that I want to show you, which takes place in the past. Uh, so let's go down here. I'm just wasting steps. This is brilliant. I think I'm just wasting steps. So we haven't really explored this part of the castle. Yeah, and all the way down here, there's a Ropon. Fossilized Ropon. You get a hex spot. It's not a hex spot. Um, it's actually a pretty powerful Ropon. I won't be using it for my plate, but if you want to use it for yours, by all means, feel free. Wow, already? Are you serious? Oh my God. <laughs> No, you're not leaving. Okay. So she ran out. So I'll cut off and show you guys the third roll pond in the past. Which I want to show you guys. BRB. Okay, guys. And the third roll pond that I want to show you guys is right here. It's on the circus in the past. And it's a platinum. Now, bear in mind. Yeah, I don't have uh, the hex spot because I kind of restarted my game. But you, know, you guys know where to get him. So here it is, the Platinum of Armed Fighter. So yeah, these are most of the Robo Pawns that I probably tend to use. Um, what? Whoa, 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 let me rephrase what I just said. No, that's not what I intend to use. Well, these are the Robo Pawns I intend to show you guys. There we go. And yeah, so I'll meet you guys. No, I just, I won't cut off. I'll make you suffer and see this way to the present. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, what the hell am I going? Okay. So she's leaving, but okay. When, when we, when will we, when will we, when will we see each other again? Please make it soon, okay? Bye bye. No, my maiden, my love, my only true love. Because I play video games and not. So we're gonna go back to the past, or present, and yeah. So what other things do I want to show you guys? You know, this is not going to be, um... Let's store our scooter. And go take out some of our robots. So we have a pretty nif nifty collection now. So, you know, I, w I really want to use Negapon, Giddyup, and... Uh... 
Prime. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, but for now, we're gonna give some last. Wait, what am, why am I getting him? Some screen time to our final members. Well, their final time with our team. We're obviously gonna keep some zero because he's a beast. He's basically kept us in the game most of the game. <laughs> That's kind of ironic. Um, so there was a few places we unlocked that we didn't really discover, and one of them was the small ruin. So let's go in here and check it out. You know, check out maybe some cool items we might find. Now the rope ponds in here are pretty weak, so we could pretty much escape every every one of them. And we get a cure three. Okay. Uh, this is gonna be nice. It's kind of bad that that we don't have um some repels. But there's actually one of the spirits that you could unlock that um repels robo robo ponds. So they act like repels. So that's pretty nifty. But yeah. Uh, there's another red mushroom here actually, so that's pretty convenient. Uh, what was that? Did we just go in a circle? Yeah, this small ruin is anything but small. Uh, we could get 350 gold around there. And let's see. Kind of lost, so. <laughs> I am anything but not lost. So I just figured we would just win a huge circle. So let's go left this time. So I'm guessing that was basically it. Oh, look at this guy. I don't even know what that guy is. Charlie. Long time no see. It's me, Charlie. I got a new place since you last saw me. Welcome to my humble adobe. Though, only 240 more years of mortgage, mortgage pay meant. My debt's so deep that I'm, I'm going to stay single. So I don't know who you are, but if I had to take a guess, you're from Mask Man. Why is this thing not lit up? It's suspicious. Let me get a love too. Um, pretty weak saw software because we basically got all of them. Um, so let's, I think this goes in a circle, so let's go back in here. Let's go all the way around here. And there's an the exit. It's a, actually pretty small ruin. Um... What's in here? We got that, okay. Um, yeah, not, not too much. I thought it was a bit bigger than what I thought, but I guess not. Um, alright, so nothing else there. Um, one other thing we could explore is my tower. Um, but we can't really explore this because there are red doors. And yes, guys, there are. There are spirits that you can unlock to get um to get through those red doors. I don't know, there's nothing there. And actually, now that I remember, there is a fatal software in that door. I completely forgot to even tell you guys, there are special softwares, one of a kind that you could get in some of these places. So once I get a red door spirit, I'll probably show you guys. It probably won't be done later. Or next episode. Because, well, you know, that's what it is. <laughs> that's how the cookie crumbles. And, oh, what? It's dot. <laughs> we get a gold battery. Perfect. Okay, so. Uh, annoying rubble ponds. So what's this door? I was going to design a Galileo window. I sh so should have. But I had vision. I had chutzpah. 
They couldn't handle my integrity and sold out. Then some kind of architect did it. What? Yeah, that made no sense. Wait. Nobody will ever understand genius. Well, you don't understand genius if it doesn't exist. Oh! <laughs> ah, this is getting really annoying. Um, but yeah, guys, nothing really much to talk about, which is kind of embarrassing because I usually don't get that. Um, but I hope you guys are enjoying the Robot series as much as I loved making it. Um, it's probably been one of my favorite games as a child. So I hope you guys go and try it out. If you've never played it, please, I beg of you, I plead you, try this game out. Because. You won't regret it. What? Uh, um, what can we throw out? Let's, yeah, let's throw it out. Anti-rust is pretty useless. An overhaul is probably um acts like a full restore, I think, or a max potion, which heals all of your HP. So it's always a good thing to carry. But yeah, let's go in this door. My hair itches. Well, not my hair, my head. We open that part of the room, and yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. The only thing we gotta check is that red door, which we will do later on. So, what else to explore? Um, another thing I've never really guys showed you is back here in the beginning, the Hoffman Tower. So let's go inside here. Um. So the Hoffman Tower is a pretty interesting um, place. Uh, not take out. Let's store some robot. This is basically like the PC of the game. Um, the more robot you store, the bigger this tower gets. Uh, I don't know if anyone explains to you that. Apparently not. Uh, no. What? We could actually go under that. Uh, let's, let's get tomorrow. Okay, we'll just get, keep some zero. I just hope I don't go into a battle that I can't handle with one Robopon. Uh, let's see. What else? We're not going to Marble Slab because there's powerful Robopons in there. At least that's what I remember. But yeah, I think we're going to cut this video short. Um... Really isn't much, 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 much more to do besides go to Death Guy. So next time on Robopon 2, and this video, it's roughly about 17 minutes, which is not too bad. It's just gonna be a bit shorter. And anyways, I'm uploading twice today, so that's another thing. Um, we're gonna have these guys. Um, so next time we're gonna come back and have these Ropons become a beast. Negapon, Giddy Up, and Platinum. No, I'm just thinking about something with this. Okay, that's why. I'm thinking, why does he have 15 speed? Um, stupid, they're level 1. <laughs> okay, so yeah, next time we do that, we're gonna have these three new members. All powered up and ready to destroy. This has been your host, Chisel Chill Speaking. I hope you liked it. If any feedback comes to my inbox, I might change my mind. And yeah, um, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. We'll, we'll probably head to Def Guy and take down the Zero Brothers. So, as saying that, I sign off. See you guys next time.